Can a zero-ohm resistor pass an infinite current? Resistors are often used in circuit design and mainly come in the form of plug-in resistors on the left and patch resistors on the right. The power calculation formula for a resistor is equal to the square of the current flowing through it multiplied by its resistance value. Based on the power of a resistor, the maximum current that can flow through a resistor of a certain resistance value can be calculated. In actual design, the power of the resistor generally has a certain margin. According to the formula, can a zero-ohm resistor pass an infinite current? The answer is definitely no. Taking patch resistors as an example, patch resistors generally labeled zero-ohms actually have a certain resistance value. When calculating the current that can pass through a zero-ohm patch resistor, its resistance value is generally taken as 50 milliohms. The values of different manufacturers may be different. You can take a look at the above. This is a screenshot of a datasheet of a resistor from a certain manufacturer. You can see that the 02010 ohm resistor is nominally less than 50 milliohms. Jumper is the corresponding name for zero ohm resistors. I summarized the relationship between the current and package of this manufacturer's zero ohm resistors. You can take a look at this table. The rated current is the resistor, which can pass this value of current for a long time without damage. The maximum current is the resistor, which can pass this value of current for a short time, but cannot pass it for a long time. Passing it for a long time may cause damage. Why share the overcurrent capability of zero ohm resistors? Mainly in circuit design, power chips often connect zero ohm resistors in series at input or output locations for debugging convenience. When the current is small, the overcurrent capability of zero ohm resistors may not be considered, but when the input or output current of the power chip is relatively large, it is necessary to consider whether the overcurrent capability of the series connected zero ohm resistor meets requirements. If the overcurrent capability does not meet the requirements of power input or output current, it is necessary to consider increasing the overcurrent capability of zero ohm resistors by paralleling several zero ohm resistors. This must be remembered, otherwise in actual circuit design, it may be possible that zero ohm resistors will burn out.